high side, although not as toasty as what they were today. Currently, we're looking at 75 in Escondido, El Cajon 79, downtown 75. And good evening in Chula Vista, you're at 72 degrees. 71 degrees already in Del Mar as we start out your morning, heading out in Poway, about 70, the same number for you into Chula Vista. Fast forward this into the afternoon. Now by 12 o'clock, look at all these nice Friday. That is right, we have a fine relief on the way. Temperature forecast for you, starting you off at about 7.30 in the morning. Those clouds will be around primarily for the coastline. To do so into the afternoon hours tomorrow as well. We're five degrees cooler out over toward Escondido, Ramona, even on into Lakeside. Temperatures tomorrow I think are going to tumble as well by about one to five. As it's going to begin to pick up a little bit of this monsoonal moisture right now hanging out toward Arizona and move it out toward our mountain and desert communities. So they have an isolated chance of a thunderstorm on in through your forecast, but that's pretty much it. We're talking about seasonal, a little bit more humidity by the time than where you were just 24 hours ago. Escondido, you're about three degrees cooler. Anticipating tomorrow afternoon for us to either fall probably is not really anything along the coast, but Encinitas around 66. These values, by the way, are seasonal for us this time of being on through. So look for cloudy skies as we start out our morning hours all the way out over toward portions of inland communities. By the afternoon, we're seasonal, but remember, it is not for long. Once we head out through about Thursday, here's the proof in your hour by hour temperature forecast, starting things off at about 7 a.m. Remember, we're going to be dealing with a lot of the cloud coverage outside. So 65 out toward Encinitas, 62 up through Escondido, and we will continue to deal with a fairly strong onshore flow, keeping our temperatures a little bit cooler than where they were today. Right now, looking at 66 degrees in Escondido. Good evening to an Alpine at Ballbrook. We have a little dip in the jet stream. This trough is actually responsible for keeping our colder air in place. It's not going to last much longer, only until we get to about Saturday. And then notice what's happening out over toward the Pacific. We see the jet stream taking a nice rise. That ridge will start to move on through. Forecast Fog forecast to move through over the early morning hours. You can see by 6 a.m. covering portions of I-15. Once we get to the 8 o'clock hour, starting to back off. Off, I think the coast it should begin to clear closer to about 10 30 jet stream far to the north and underneath it is all the warm air and it is so expansive spreading all the way from Florida out of, or rather from California all the way out, out, out toward the plains. Now there is a little bit of cooler air in our forecast that should begin to arrive close to Wednesday. It's going to start to nudge in. I don't think we're really going to feel its effects though along the coast until Friday. I'm Chief Meteorologist Sabrina find dense fog possible yet again over the early morning hours by 7 a.m. possibly pushing for portions of I-15. I think once we get closer to 9 30, 10 o'clock, we start to see it fade away, allowing sunshine to come out, but temperatures beginning to cool. We'll talk about that in your full forecast. We'll be right back.